Hello everybody. My name is Hans Korsman and I come from Apto Fidelity. Uh, today I'm going to show you how easy it is to measure the performance of your user interface software by using the watchdog uh, system from Apto Fidelity. Uh, for the demo we've selected an Apple iTouch uh, device and we're going to measure how quickly it responds to, uh, to your finger touch uh, in the calculator application. Uh, first of all, we'll just power up the device and uh, go and select the uh, calculator. Then we'll turn on the watchdog system. And now it records your finger press movements and also all the visual events from the user interface. So I'll just go ahead and click a couple of times, get numbers into the screen. And as you can see on the graph down there, uh, we're getting all kinds of visual events and we're recording images based on that. Uh, then we can just stop the test and it'll process the video stream for a while and then it'll pop up a report. So on the report it's very easy to see how quickly the user interface reacted to our key presses. Uh, on the left here we have the uh, user interactions and then on the right uh, two events we have uh, the response of the user interface. And on the first column, we'll, we'll see the absolute time and the time from the last event. So, so these are the timestamps that we can, we can uh, review. Uh, so if we look at the report a little bit, basically the first key press uh, was recorded as the zero timestamp. And from that, uh, 60 milliseconds later, uh, something started to happen on the user interface. If we click on the on the detected event, we'll see a, a film strip uh, of all the frames that were captured during the test, and we have we see one uh, image that is framed in red, which is the detected event. So basically, here uh, we we can see that the uh, the other number was added added to the uh, display there. So going back to the main report, uh, we can then see basically all the key presses. Uh, so we, we uh, detect the time when the key was pressed and then when the user interaction or, or the user interface uh, reacted to that user interaction. And we can see the time from the I.O. event, which is the user interaction. Uh, it stays pretty much constant uh, all the way through. So we got 50 milliseconds, 60 milliseconds, uh, 50 milliseconds. So a fairly consistent device. Uh, based on the uh, on the report uh, we also also uh, record the test parameters so that we can uh, redo the test later if needed that was pretty much it that's all you need to do uh, thanks for your time uh, watching this video uh, please go ahead and, and check our website for more demonstrations and more information about the uh, watchdog system thanks bye